Hey guys, this is Autumn with KAJ Bath and Body, back to make you another soap. So it's been a little over a month since I did a video. I've been super busy with the holidays and um, spending time with the family. But I am back and getting ready to do a bunch of good videos for you guys and some awesome soaps. Here, this, this soap is named uh, Flower Fields. And it's just kind of a brighter, lighter soap. And it's got some embeds and a lot of bright colors so i hope you enjoy the video um stick around and the cut will be at the end of it and you'll see uh, pictures of the finished bars all right i'll pop back in and talk to you more in a minute i decided that i wanted to go for a pastel um, look so I'm adding a little bit of TD to all of my colors to just try to lighten them up Now in the end, I wasn't really happy with the orange color. It was it was a little too vibrant I wish it was more pastel But other than that the colors turned out perfect and you'll see me mix them all up in um, this uh, clip right here on me so we are in a super big hurry and depending on how this goes it will either it's going to be probably a hanger swirl we'll see oh yeah come on it's definitely going to be a hanger swirl because we are Need to hurry. and we're going to make the second layer to my soap which is actually going to have um, some embeds in it and it's not going to just be a plain white so I've got this second batch um, it's already got the lye it's got um, the clodo oats and my kaolin clay and I've lightly mixed it it's not yet emulsified not yet okay so I'm going to add my TD and my fragrance oil let's get some little td in there find my little thing now my soap always needs a good amount of td just because like i said before i use extra virgin olive oil and extra virgin olive oil is uh, ridiculously dark so in order for me to have a white soap i gotta add a lot of td let's give this a quick whirl and see where we're at that's about as white as it's gonna get this is my fragrance oil i'm using sea salt and yuzu from b scented
Okay. I want to hurry up because this does accelerate between the TD and the fragrance oil. This soap does speed up a little bit. And, and I have some super cute embeds that I want to get in here. So let's make sure I get batter in all the crevices of that textured layer. That looks good. Tap it down so it gets it everywhere it needs to go. Okay. And I have these cute little embeds that I worked on. Just little flower shapes. And we're just going to put them wherever we feel like putting them. That is way too long. I love this one. That is way too long too. Holy moly. I do not have time to be fussing with this. This is speeding up so ridiculously fast. It's okay though. See if we can get some more flowers in here. Work with what we got. Sometimes fragrance oil just has a mind of its own. That's all right. Got to keep your wits about you. Try not to panic. Stay focused. Don't make no mistakes. Because you just got to pay attention to what you're doing. And kind of push these down a little bit. Oh, where's my green one? These green ones kind of look like string beans. Let's get this last bit on. We are going to be doing a lot of tapping down. Because this has gotten super duper 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 thick on us, which is fine. I've worked with thicker soap, so we will make it work. Okay. I need some room. Okay, we're gonna bang this on the floor. I'm going to clean this up and bring you back.
right, it's time to cut this soap and we'll see what it looks like. There it is. And I like this bar. The colors on the bottom have brightened up a lot more. Now that they've got some air, the pink has been, um, has become a lot brighter and it's not so muddled. You'll see that in the pictures at the end. The, all of the embeds on top are made out of soap dough. I cut them all out with uh, different cookie cutters and um, the white balls are made out of soap dough too and I just covered those with mica, with a pearlescent mica. So yeah, it's a super fun soap. All right, if you would like to see more videos like this from me, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up with this video. I really appreciate you watching this one. I hope I see you in the next one. Talk to you later. Thank you. See you later.